Yep. Yeah. Oh, send him in. Yeah. Okay. Hello, you. Hiya. Hi. Are you okay? I'm good, though, fans. I'm good. Yeah, as H. Yeah, great. Yeah, I'm still doing fame. Oh, I want to live forever. I can't believe I still haven't been down to see it. Honestly, it's a tragedy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so, honestly, it's been mental here. Well, so let me know when you want to come see. I will do, definitely. Yeah, as soon as I get a couple of hours, I am going to be down there. Ooh. Right, now what can I uh, what can I do for you? Well, uh, I don't know what to start, really. Um, okay, I'll well, take your time. Well, do you remember what we did before I went into the Big Brother house? Of course I do, yeah. We told the press about your little gay thing, didn't we? They yeah. couldn't believe it. <laughs> well, I mean, that was just great the way you handled that whole thing. Oh, wow, that's my job, baby. I, I said to the 3am girls, you know, whole page 19, ladies. <laughs> I've got you the new Barrymore. <laughs> Obviously, without the swimming pool. Yeah. Um, well, you see, the thing is, um, well, I'm, I may need your help on that one again. Well, yeah. Um, you know, this whole gay thing, well, I've decided, well, it's, it's just not for me. How do you mean? Well, I actually don't think I'm gay. <laughs> well, what are you talking about, Dan? Of course you're gay. Well, looking back, you know, I think I was just you know, confused. You know, I was working hard, I was really stressed, and I just don't know what I wanted. Is this some kind of joke, Ian? I mean, what, what, what are you talking about? I just want you to call the newspapers for me. Uh, what are you trying to do to me? Uh, we've got Serena McKellen's birthday bash in a couple of weeks. We're supposed to be singing a song. I just want people to know the truth. What, do you actually think that I'm going to phone up the tabloid newspapers and say to them, oh, hello, yes, you know that Ian came out of the closet at the beginning of the year. Well, actually now, he just wants to go back in again. Because I'm not going to. Well, maybe I should get myself a new publicist then, then. Well, hang on a minute. Now, hang on a minute, Ian. Just let's hold our horses. All I'm saying is... I just think it's going to be better for everyone if you remain a nice, cheerful, lovely, everybody's friend, homosexual. Call them! Right, well, I mean, I'll call them. Should I just call them now? Mm. Right, I mean, I'm, who cares if my reputation's in tatters? Okay, I will call them. I mean, for fuck's sake, hello, yes, showbiz desk, please. Yeah, Victoria. Hello, my darling, it is Jan Bursley. Hello there, I'm very well. How's you? Excellent. Now listen, Victoria, I've got uh, a bit of an exclusive for you actually concerning our good friend Ian Watkins. H? From Steps? Yes, now, uh, actually, you remember about him coming out at the beginning of the year? I know, we all were. We all were. Well, actually, Ian has decided that he's not gay, after all. Yeah. No, he's, uh, he doesn't really fancy it. Yeah, I know. <laughs> so he's come out and then he's gone back in again. <laughs> in, out, shake it all about. <laughs> That's a good headline for you, actually. <laughs> but without the cokey. Yeah. <laughs> Victoria? Fix? Maybe you should be a bit more convincing next time. Right, listen here, you little Welsh piece of shit. Hi, you gorgeous. Oh, yeah, I'm just wrapping things up. I'll see you back at the house. I we'll love it when you talk dirty. <laughs> you don't let the bath go cold. <laughs> oh, that was Abby. Titmus? Yeah. For fuck's sake. Okay, I'd better be off. Right, now hang on a minute. If you're not gay, take me now. What? Come on, Mr. Straight Boy. Let's do it on the desk right now. Come on. I could, you know. another ring, shall I? And should we say same time next week? If you're lucky. <laughs> Bye, Dave. <laughs> Hello. Showbiz desk, please. Victoria? Yeah, forget what I said earlier about Ian. He's definitely gay. <laughs> 